how to join a table with common attribute in QGIS. GIS. So for this, I have an example here. Again, I left some points. Let's say that here we make some points. Let's make them red. It will be better. Uh, yeah, red at night. Okay. And then I show you. I will create some new one here. Okay. Uh, I want new point. Okay, just the ID. With the ID, I, I left a number, number 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Let's put number 10. I think I have 10 points. Let's say one dot is a species, and from the field, you add a paper book, a notebook, and you have also the number of your points, you know, number 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, etc. And you left some information species, sex, age, observer, date. Let's put number 14, for example. So from the field on a paper book, you wrote, okay, my observation number 14 is a giraffe. Okay, it's a female. She's uh, five years old. It's Robert, Robert. Thanks, Robert. And it was seen this day. Okay. Okay, for example. And you want all those information to be also on your QGIS project. You want to left the, those attributes, those fields, also here in your point. Because so far, if I open it, if I open the attribute table, there is only ID, nothing else. Okay? So if I ask question for this point, ID, okay, number one. Okay. So, here, what is very important is to have something in common. And here, in common, we have the ID, the name, the point, the point name. One, two, three, four, five. Here, it's not important to have the same uh, he heading. What we need is something in common. We know that point number one is the point number one here. Okay? And then, because we have a common attribute, we have a common column, we have a common field, same, it's a synonym, uh, we can join, we can merge the tables. Okay, let's look how we can do that. So, I will save this uh, table, it's here, called exo, okay, I will put it, I keep it with my mouse, and I'll put it here. Obviously, it's just a table because there is no coordinates, so I cannot put it here. I have no coordinates, otherwise, it was just something with layer, add layer, add layer with text. Where is it? Uh, I lost it. Uh, yeah, this one. And then uh, you can see my video number, I don't remember. There is a video where I explain how to put a table with coordinates uh, in your project. But here we cannot, we, ha we have to merge. So, if I go on my, uh, on my layer of points, okay, my lions and giraffes, I right click, I go in property, or I double, double click, and here there is something that should be interesting for us. Attribute, form, and joins, here, joins. So, let's join. Our table. So here you click on plus. It proposes to you. Okay, what do you want to join? We want to join exo this uh, this table. Okay, so you can choose if there is several. Anyway, there is only one here. Then I want to join this with uh, with my target. Uh, no, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, yes. Anyway, he knows that I want to join it with census because I selected it. But now I, will, I have to explain to him what column I need to merge. Okay, so what is the co common column? In my case, the target field is only ID because I have only one. So I have no choice, it's ID. And here I know that it's point for me. Okay, remember, so this column point will be merged with ID because with ID I have one, two, three, four, five. Same. 
cache join layer virtual memory, ok, da 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 da, sounds cool, let's go. Apply, join layer, exo, ok. And now, if I open census, if I open the attribute table, oh ho, I can recognize ID, uh, exo feuillant species, sex, age, observer, date. Okay, obviously, I can change that, but it's more pedagogic. Uh, if I ask about a point like this one, or actually the first one you saw, number one, so it's point number one, but now we know the species is Pantera Leo, lion, it's a male, three years old, observer David, it was seen the 14th of January, same for all the points. Cool. So you see, we merge, we join. Uh, a table with our point attributes. Sounds cool, huh? So I guess for your project can be very useful.